Hi, welcome to our latest system here, Arch Linux version 6.8.3 in this instance. And we're on Openbox, as you can see at the window manager here. So, topic of the video is JG menu. What is this? Control Alt T. Pseudo Pacman. Or maybe Trizen. Trizen says more. Gives you text. Pacman doesn't give you any text. So type in the name you have, and then it says small x11 menu intended to be used with Openbox and Tin2. That's why I launched Openbox. So the idea of Openbox is to have a let's move it around here is to have a right mouse click, right? Terminal, file manager, you get this menu. There is nothing up here. There is yes, desktop one, desktop two, three, and the system tools there. But there is no actual start button like in normal uh, desktops, what we normally expect. We just expect it, it's just not normal, you know? The thing is, we can add a menu, and this, this is a menu, this is one of them. And this is G, J, G menu. And if I say, okay, install it, I can use Trizen. It's going to get it anyway via Pacman from the community. So the same thing can be done with just pseudo Pacman minus S menu. Let's install it. It's not going to come on our ISOs. It's not our intention to have a start menu every and up here, but we'll make it in this video so you can do it follow along and you have this start button up there later on. We rely on the right mouse button. There is also super spacebar and it also calls the menu. There is also another way to call the menu that's maybe interesting to explain. I always teach more than I'm letting on in the title of the video. So I have here open box somewhere, open box. Here it is, how to start and what we Edit was this one, escape, escape. If you say run this one, then when we press on the super, then it will also pop up uh, a menu. So that's also a nice tip that's included already. So, J, J, G menu thingy. Okay, control T, what you're probably gonna do is just type the, the thing in, and then you say, oh, something's happening up here. We, we just saw something, right? Control C. We just saw a menu popping up and we can navigate over it. And this is one of the reasons why we're not going to put it in there because it has too many of these elements. That's because we mix three desktops together. That's the result. So, okay. So if, if you say, okay, I don't mind. I just keep out of those menus and just want to have something there. Then what's the next thing we've installed? G, J menu and how to get it there. Well, this is the TIN2 and TIN2 is our um, menu panel that we have. So if we could get it in here, that would be great, right? So right mouse click, system settings, preferences, going to look for TIN2, okay, the GUI. Best and easiest way is just say double click whatever panel you've chosen up here is going to be edited. It's in your own home folder, as you can see. And then we need to have a way to put it there. Now go over every one of them. And then you say, oh, I'm missing here something. The panel items, I need to add a launcher. It launches applications. I've never put launchers in there. I don't like them, don't want them. My launchers are here and in all the shortcuts that you can visit here. Let's show you that as well. Display key bindings in a new window. There are a lot of key bindings. Yeah. So in the meantime, they're all in my fingers. So I don't need uh, any menu. I just click on keyboard combinations. So we have a launcher. It's up here. Now what's in the launcher? Not Nothing yet. Here's a launcher. Nothing is in here. So I need to find my JG thingy and that's almost here. Well, the rocket, a little rocket, depending on the icons you have and all that. So click up here and then we have a element that's going to pop up 
here. Why there? Because we said in here it should go all up. Then you get the taskbar, then you get the system tray, and then you get the clock. So yeah, that's it. Go that way. Apply. Okay, so this means with this action we have this button up here. And now we can go and click. It's a little bit transparent. Don't know for sure why that is. But this is our menu. Maybe it's our theme. We should investigate that further. But this is JG menu. The thing will never implement in our systems. But if you want to have it, these are just fine. They are not too big. It's only here when it gets really nasty. All right, enjoy JG menu. Cheers.